Chuck Perfect. and I had no idea this Can stuff happened. Can you tell happened. I have a uh, uh, an injury? Uh, an injury on my forehead. Well, I mean, when you do like this, mm-hmm. I am. My eyes are drawn. I, it Does looks that, as Chuck said after I put makeup on it. It looks like a like a cut with makeup over it. Uh, oh, I was gonna say a, it lot like a little curling iron burn. So I had a a, a self inflicted beauty wound yesterday I, because I recently went to a dermatologist and she said, you know. When instead of microplaning, which the women listening will know, microplaning, they kind of do this. They take a straight razor and no. Yeah. Well, no. so she said, you know, like, guys, they, their faces look like babies, butts when they shave because they're sloughing oh, off their bad skin. OK, so um, yesterday, for some reason, I whip out no. like the roughest, worst Bic razor. Stop. I did. And I just right. slammed it on my forehead. I have two track marks from where the razor okay. hit me. But I have no hair. Like uh, that no, witchy hair that comes out on my chin every once in a while, gone. gone. But you did You did your forehead. Who shaves their forehead? That's why I know. wanted you guys to say, have you ever shaved, have you ever heard of shave your face? Okay, but I, I'm not. Go, go. I mean, go. you got a beard. I'm gonna, I'm, I'm, that, was, that was the sound of me stuffing words back into my mouth. No, don't. Ooh, don't. As a wise right. man does. I, I have a 15-year-old son who has just sort of crossed into, holy crap, He's a chia pet. Oh, yeah. There's like, he can blow his nose and hair just like, <laughs> but it doesn't go completely. Like, he's slightly Brad Paisley about it. Oh, he's it. patchy. Yeah, he's kind of patchy. Pet- mm-hmm. And some people's constitution, I'm, roll with me. I'm going there. Go some people's genetics constitution, their genetics are different, different, different. And so maybe you don't need a rusty bick. Well, to I mean, to shave clear, your forehead. I was not doing this. But we all know where this was going. Maybe what you need is like, like a very new hot, so as men, I, this is one of the things I taught my son because mm-hmm. he has very little hair, mm-hmm. is you run the razor under hot, hot, hot water mm-hmm. first. I'm, I'm oh, there you go. Right? And you get out of the shower after a hot shower so that your hair's ready on your face. Yeah. And then that's, so I'm like helping this. you. Yeah, it really opens I, up no, the pores, Kelly. Do not do this. But what about? Put down the razor. I mean, I think there are other <laughs> ways to just put down look, they the come sharp up with implement. Stuff. They come up with stuff all the time uh-huh. for women, right? Because it, whatever the next best new thing is, we're going to be like, yeah, I'm going to try it. But no, anything involving a razor, because it's just something else for them to try to do for you when really, I mean, there's lots of like, you know, glycolic, like little chemical, little, yeah, yeah, little citric peel, yeah. like whatever yeah. that, that will do it better than a 